What's up guys, it's your boy Richie Reels and today we will be reviewing Prada Luna Rosa. Um, it was made by Daniela Andrea Roach girl. She's made a lot of Pradas. Made in 2012. This is a modern scent. It's a citrus aromatic fragrance. Top notes are lavender and bitter orange. This, like, when you first spray it on, you smell the smooth lavender. It's not like this girly lavender I've smelled in a lot of girl stuff. Um, it's like really good. And the bitter orange. Um, supposedly it's supposed to have like a grapefruit-esque orange-ish. I was getting more of like an orange-ish lemon. Uh, so was my mom. And so I think they're... I mean, it's really good. It's what I'm looking for in a citrusy scent. That's like, that is what this bitter orange is great. And they put a lot in it too because it lasted. Like, even after it settled, you could still smell like hints in the scent. And that's what I like to see with the citrus scent. Not just the first 15 minutes. That's just only to please me. I want to please other people with a good citrus and... So there's that. So middle notes are mint and clary sage. Usually it's really hard to smell mint in a lot of these because like it's like the mint they use. Um, you could smell like tiny hints and with the clary sage like you kind of the, like slight earthy notes. The middle notes they don't really stand out to me but there is one thing I like to say. Well actually I guess they kind of do. Well there's one thing I like to say about this scent in particular is you can smell every note because the base notes are Ambrette and Ambroxan which are musk scents which are fresh scents which is really weird because a lot of people when they think of a musky scent they think sandalwood, patchouli, um, maybe amber, oud, I don't know. Uh, but like actual musk usually just smells like freshness and so yeah it is a very fresh scent here's the problem with it. the projection is not good there's another Prada scent like the Lahome my mom had to get right up in my chest to smell it which shouldn't happen like ever for her so I don't like that and I know it was just this little sample and I know it was like a legit sample and I had to spray oh the reason I haven't sprayed me on or I'm smelling myself is because I had to spray the whole sample on because I and longevity is also not good so what happened was I uh, sprayed uh, 15 little squirts with this and after an hour I was just like not smelling it so I sprayed the rest and after an hour after that I was not smelling again so that's kind of my problem with this is maybe in a regular bottle you'll get the performance but I know Prada's has performance too like this isn't like this Lunarosa and the Lahome for some reason for me didn't perform I guess the Lahome I'd see a little bit better than this I'd say the Lahome would be Lahome would be like my bare minimum of what I think it should at least project in longevity. This is a little under that and I don't like that and yeah it's not good. Which is weird because people online are saying the opposite. So that makes me think maybe I need a full size bottle. Uh, you never know. I will say I think this is an even better scent than Prada Lahome. Um, it's not got that powderiness. I don't know. I don't really want to smell that in an office, if that makes sense. But this is just fresh, clean, um, citrusy. You're not going to offend people. And it's just like a mass people pleaser, you know. Yeah, definitely. This is another springy, summer day scent. Very fresh. It's another word that I'll use in this video is fresh. Fresh, fresh, fresh. So it smells much less like being brought to home. A bit earthy, tiny bit spicy. I think it's great. Uh, let's put a picture of the bottle up here. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Uh, 
not like the coolest bottle, but kind of cool. I think this scent also might be good for a date. Because you really can get compliments from the ladies from what I've experienced. Uh, maybe I need more of this stuff. Someone just sent it to me, please. I don't want to spend the money. Uh, maybe you just need more of this stuff. Um, but ladies, on a date, you know, if the girl gets up close to you, this might be good. So scent also, after a while, it doesn't really change like much. Like, um, when it settles, it like kind of starts to lose that citrus and lavender that I really like when you first spray it on. But it's still there a little. And it just doesn't really like evolve, you know. But yeah, I think there's better scents out there and stronger, better projecting scents. Um, you just gotta find them. And uh, so this is one, it's on my radar for in the future maybe uh, but as of right now I don't think I would make this purchase within the next two years you know maybe after that but overall great fresh scent there's nothing wrong with it at all except well what I talked about uh, but like the scent itself there's nothing wrong with it um, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you later